Have you ever wondered how to get your torso and your waist measured to get your backpack fitted? Then this video is going to show you exactly how. Let's go. Hello fellow hiker and world traveller, Russ here bringing you the best tips and inspiration for hiking around the world. Okay, so a couple of days ago I was in the Lake District with Tom Gale, founder of Atom Packs, and he measured me up to get my very own Atom Plus fitted and ready to go. Uh, so I'm just going to cut to some footage to show you exactly how he measured me up uh, to get my backpack fitted. <laughs> Never done this, this before. Is, this is going on the internet. How big is my waist? <laughs> Okay, here we go. Cool, so we're gonna, Tom is very there's a certain way that you measure up a back, and Tom's gonna show us how you measure up your torso length. Okay. Cool, so we're gonna aim for the, uh, take a flexible tape measure. If you don't have a flexible tape measure, you can just use a piece of string or a piece of cloth or whatever you have, and then just apply that to um, a fixed ruler or something. We're gonna aim for the C7 vertebrae, which if Russell points his head forwards, is like the bony, the bony vertebrae that sticks out round about here. So in Russell's case, that's there. So it's sort of like right in between, um, right in between your shoulders there. Um, we're going to measure from there down the curvature of his back to kind of his iliac crest, which is the top of. You put your hands on the top of your hip bones, or all, and kind of poke your fingers in towards your spine. So bring your thumbs in towards your back. It's generally right on like the top of somebody's uh, where they wear their shorts or where the where the waist belt is. So let's have a little look here. I'm imagining you're going to be about an 18. Yeah, 18. Oh, yeah. Hang on. Still. No, yeah, so that's fine. So we've got we've got your got your measurement from here, following down the back, right in between your thumbs. You're sort of 18, 18 and a half, so you're bang on medium. So any of our medium sized sacks will fit you perfectly. So there's parts of my body that I didn't even know existed. <laughs> oh, yeah. Tom found them. <laughs> cool. So uh, and then the the waist measurement we're just aiming for uh, you just measure it around your uh, on top of your hip bones. So sort of from, from hip top so of the hip top. Top of the hip bone there. Yeah. And then all we'll the way around to the other hip bone. And that's that's literally almost 28. Coming, yeah, coming a little. There we go. Yeah, that's so bang on 28. Yeah, so you're so 20, yeah. 28 there. So you want you want the uh, the padded the padded portion of the pack to be covering your um, just covering the hip bones and then this part we can have some adjustment. You've got to allow for a bit of weight loss, especially on a long a long distance walk. Um, cool. Also for like winter layers, if you're gonna be doing a lot of winter mountaineering, you probably want a slightly wider hip bone because you're gonna be you're going to be going over all those extra layers yeah. and stuff. Um, the cool. joy of having something like the Atom is the, the hip hop's replaceable, so you can just whip it off and order a new one from us in 2050. Cool. Wonderful. Cool. So that's how you get measured up. Excellent. Right. Okay, so that is exactly how you get your torso and your waist measured up to get your backpack fitted. Thanks so much for watching this video. Thumbs if you liked it, subs if you loved it, and I'll see you in the next one.